Welcome to a short presentation on the disaster management system in the Netherlands. Now, talking about the organizational structure of the system, it's important to distinguish the difference between a, an emergency and a crisis. Now, the distinction be between these two is the distinction of what type of system is going to be implemented to respond. Now, an emergency is more of a bottom-up type structure, and a crisis is more of a top-down. Now, they define an emergency as a very localized disaster, something very small that only affects one or few munis municipalities. Now, a crisis is considered a disaster which will affect national security in, in the most broad sense. There are several hundred municipalities in Holland. Each one is responsible for responding to an emergency within their own municipality. Now, they have their own emergency services such as the fire, fire department, police, and medical services. Once an emergency escalates and affects more than one municipality, safety regions become taken into effect. Now, there are 25 safety regions in the Netherlands, and each safety region consists of several municipalities. Now, these safety regions were created to increase collaboration and cooperation between the municipalities and to eventually increase eff efficiency and the effectiveness of disaster response. Now, when a national crisis occurs, the national government assumes responsibility for responding to a disaster. A, once a, a crisis occurs, a ministerial commission will be created, which will be presided over the by, presided by the Minister of Interior Affairs, unless the Prime Minister wants to preside. There's an important note, though, that if the crisis was, has occurred because of an act of terror, the Minister of Justice will preside over these commissions. Now, in 2011, a World Risk Report was released, and in this, this World Risk Report evaluated 173 countries. They evaluated each country's exposure to disasters, vulnerability, and sustainability. Now, this report ranked the Netherlands as the 12th most exposed country with an exposure rating of 29.24%. That's very high for a first world country. To put that in perspective, the United States has an exposure rating of 12%. Now, that's not the most important thing this World Risk Report released. This report also created a World Risk Index. Now, this index is the probability that a country would be affected by a disaster. The World Risk Index for the Netherlands is 7.71%. That means they have a 7.71% of 7.71% percent probability of a disaster occurring within that country. Now, that ranks 69th out of 173. That is relatively low compared to their such such high exposure rating. Now, to put that in perspective again, the United States has a as a world risk index of 3.72%. Now, many would argue that such low world risk index of the Netherlands is a good example of how effective their emergency management system is being used. Thank you, Gonos.